Yo, what's up YouTube? It's your boy Smeekwo and in today's video, we're going to be finding out if a high school player can actually beat Vince Carter in a dunk contest. So we got Vince Carter up here and then we got one of the best high school players in the nation right now. Probably the best in my opinion, Zion, Zion Williamson out here and then we also got Andre Ball he's a sick dunker and Marvin Bagley the third who is also crazy at dunking so any of these guys could really take the competition but I'm betting it on Williamson maybe he can actually beat Vince Carter so we're doing a CPU simulation in the dunk contest right now and we're actually just gonna advance to it and see how it actually turns out all right guys all right, so we got Andre Ball up here first. I think if anybody's going to take it, it's going to be Zion. He's got some crazy dunks in real life. He's pretty much known for that. Well, here we go. Andre Ball with the first dunk. That was actually pretty decent through the legs, like a behind the... Oh, that was actually pretty crazy. I'm going to give him a 45 for that dunk. Leave a comment down below who you think is going to win if you think one of these high schoolers can beat Vince Carter. But Andre Ball with the first dunk of the game. I think it's a 37. That was only a 37. Usually, I don't know. They rate kind of dunks here. That was a crazy dunk. But we got Zion coming up here. And that was that was pretty nice. A little like alley-oop to himself behind the rim. That's probably going to get a better score than Andre Ball. We'll find out here though. 43. See, I don't think that was as good, but... 2k gives him a better rating still a really impressive dunk but we got vince carter up next on the cleveland cavaliers this is from when he was in his prime so when he was in the dunk contest and everything but let's see what he pulls out on his first dunk it's got to be something crazy okay he touched the backboard and then does a little windmill in my opinion that's not too impressive that's not too hard but i know 2k likes to give a pretty good rating for that I give him around a 40, but let's see what 2K ends up giving him. He gets a 47. That wasn't even too nice. We got Marvin Bagley. I don't even know who this guy is, to be honest, but apparently he's good at dunking. So first dunk for him. We couldn't even see that. That was like the um, Aaron Gordon dunk underneath his legs. That was pretty nice. Probably going to get 47 for that as well. So Vince Carter and Marvin Bagley out in the league. Not what I'm expecting. Obviously, I thought Vince Carter would be out there. But this Bagley dude, don't know who he is, but he's doing pretty good so far. Andre Ball coming up again. So it's three dunks, and whoever has the highest score at the end wins. Not good for Andre Ball here with his poor first dunk. So let's get this started. What can he do here? He's going to throw it up to himself. And just a basic little windmill. Probably going to be higher than his last one. Maybe around a 40 to 43. I'm thinking. What's he going to get? A 43. So Andre Bell puts up a pretty good score there. Okay. Zion Williamson. What's he going to do? What's he going to do here? What was that? Did he tap the rim? That was like Vince Carter's too. Except Vince Carter already did it. Okay, I'm honestly not even sure what he did there. Like, what was that? He switched hands? He hit it off the backboard? I don't even know. What did he do? He got a 45, though. So, impressive score for him. But not better than Vince Carter here. We got Vince Carter out back here. So, he got a 47 on his first thing. I wonder what it takes to get a 50. Probably if you do a free throw line. That was a low dunk. That was pretty nice. That was pretty nice through the legs. Not as good as his last one. But that was really good. Not a doubt. A 43 for him. So he's still in the lead, I believe. It depends on Marvin out here. What he's going to do. This dude's averaging a crazy amount of points. But he's going to go up for his dunk. Okay, so he covered his eyes. Covered his eyes here. A little dabbing out here. Not too bad. Got a dab, cover the eyes, and he slams it down with the 360. And he gets a 40. Okay. A 40? Yeah, I give him around that too. That's not a bad score. And at the end of the second round, 
Zion Williamson is actually one point behind Vince Carter, who's in the lead with 90, but it's still really close. Andre Ball falling behind here. Let's see how it finishes off. I think this is the last dunk, and we're going to be finding out our winner after this. So Andre Ball up here first. Doesn't look like he's going to end up being able to win this. That was decent. That wasn't the best dunk. What did he do there? Left hand behind him, kind of held the back of his head. Didn't uh, Zach Levine do a dunk kind of like that? Pretty nice. Not too bad. 47. He got a 47 on that? Okay. I guess. Gonna give him an oop. And just a basic one-handed dunk. That was nothing special there. He does better dunks in games in real life. That was still nice though. What are they gonna give him? 37. I think he just blew it there on that. Because we got Vince Carter up next. And if he throws down something good here. I don't think Zion's even going to make it in the top two. Vince Carter going to uh, throw it up to himself again. And a windmill. Thought he was going up for the two-hander. But he hits him with the windmill. I give him a, I give him a 43 on that dunk. What's 2K going to do? 39. Yo, I think these ratings are kind of off on 2K. But Vince Carter still has been throwing down some of the best dunks. We got Marvin Bagley up here. Can he actually end up winning this? Beating out Vince Carter. What can he do here? Through the legs. And a nice two-handed dunk. I think people have already done that in this competition. He shouldn't get too high. 37. Yeah, it wasn't too impressive there. But we're going to be fighting out the winner here. I wasn't keeping track of how the scores were going. But Vince Carter ends up winning with 129 points. Andre Ball comes back in second. Zion comes third. And then Marvin Bagley comes in last place. But it was all super close. But the champ himself, Vince Carter, ends up holding on to his title as one of the best dunkers of all time. High schoolers were not able to beat him out. But there you go, guys. If you did enjoy this video, leave a comment down below if you got the right. If you picked Vince Carter. Did you get him right or did you pick a high schooler? Anyways, guys, go check out all my social media in the description down below. Give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. This has been your boy Sweekle and I'll see you next time. Peace.